Hello and Namaste everyone from Malaysia. Welcome back again to another new video of Busy Vlogs. I hope all of you are fine. So I was getting a lot of suggestion way to visit in Kuala Lumpur city in Malaysia. So I am taking one of your suggestion guys and going to Genting Highlands which is like 50 km from here from the city of Kuala Lumpur and it will take one hour for us to reach there. So I will show you where the Genting Highlands is located. So guys I am right here in my room and the Genting Highlands are located somewhere there on the top of that Mount Ulu Hill. I think that one is the Mount Ulu Hill. We cannot see the Genting Islands from here because it is above clouds. The cloud is covering them. So we are going there today. This is the view from my room. This one is the hotel. And we are going there today. in this hotel and guess what this is the old largest hotel certified by guinness world records with 7321 rooms overall right now i'm inside the mall this one is a very big mall here and there is guy casino here so we're going inside to have a look how it looks from inside i don't know if it if it is allowed to shoot inside or not i'll be showing you if it is allowed Finally, after a very beautiful ride through the misty road, we are here in Genting Highlands. As you can see, the weather here is a lot more foggy and I am feeling a little bit cold but not so cold. I am not putting my jacket right now, I am not feeling so much cold. And This one is the pillar for cable car and we cannot see that cable car also. So just imagine guys, how foggy it is right now here. The temperature here is like this most of the time. We are in like about 27 degrees Celsius in Kuala Lumpur. Right now here it's about 19 degree sudden drop in temperature but I'm not feeling so cold it's okay for me the temperature is like I can handle it we are in the entrance of Genting Sky Walls this one is the theme park in Genting Highlands and after some times we'll go inside or the weather I cannot believe guys so this is my ticket guys and now I'm going inside the park I'm already inside the park theme park the weather here is not so nice I don't know how I'll dream it, but I'll show you as much as I can. This place normally is very clouded and as usual today is also it is very crowded and the weather is also not nice what is many people are coming here as this is one of the very famous tourist attraction here. And there are many rides in this park, so I'm going in one of the rides, but we have to wait for our turn to get to the ride. So I'm just walking and looking which ride should I go. Even there is building, we cannot see that building also. And yeah, okay, sorry, you had what the booking? Reservation. Reservation is ah, mandatory? Yes, ah, booking. This is not enough? Ah, no, no, this is what it is. Uh, you have to for all the rides or what? Uh, only three rides. Only three uh, rides reservation required. Is any global? Uh, uh, upper icon, I can get ready. Okay, okay. 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 I think no reservation is required in this one. Okay, this is 3D one, 3D ride. So I am wearing the 3D goggles. Are you good? Yeah. Okay.
that was not so interesting right for me because there was no adrenaline rush. I wanted adrenaline rush. So now the weather is now a little bit cleared up. You can see the cable car also. part of this theme park I was here in another part there were not many rides and this part has got many rides and people too so if I pick one ride I have to wait a lot I think like that because see see the line long queue is there for this ride I'm not going here now I'm here in Crash City's frozen treats ice age theme park I think so oh, that one is nice This one is the entrance for this ride, Samba Gliders. Reservation required for this ride? Yeah. Reservation required for this ride? Yeah. yeah. So, would have reservation cannot? Yeah. You can know what to wait for the longer queue. Oh, longer yeah. queue. How many minutes have to wait? Yeah, you can see the waiting 30, time. 30. 30 minutes. Huh? Oh. Uh, 30 minutes for this ride, guys. Reservation means we can go faster. Without reservation, we have to wait 30 minutes. Okay. That is like a lot of time. I don't think I'll be going that to ride. So I'll be exploring around other places. So guys, I finally found a ride where the waiting time is less, only 5 minutes. And it seems interesting too. That one was one hell of a ride. That one was too interesting. Very short one, only like one minute or not even one minute. What the Adeline Ross was too much. I liked it. This one is another one. Playhouse. This doesn't seem interesting by the name. Okay, this one is so theater show for children. We can also watch, but I am not interested in that. I want to go to another ride, but with less waiting time okay i just did that right just one round of that and finished i was thinking of going to this ride again and i came here and it's like 40 minute waiting time again the waiting time is 40 minutes it's okay there are so many people here 40 minutes is okay and after that i'll go out finally guys almost after 50 minutes we are here for the ride, I think I will not be able to record because of the speed and the rules here. So, I'll see you after finishing the ride. It was okay. But not so scary for me.
I was not scared at all. So I'm out now. And I think it's raining. No, it's not raining. Seems quite interesting, but again, the waiting time is there. As always, there was like 20 minutes waiting time. But now I'm getting out. I almost saw all the rides. Most of them were closed, but I think I saw most of the rides here. This one was just an entry point and exit point. Nothing much here. Closing so it is now going to be soon closed. So that was the closing ceremony. I think for today, every day I think it happens. Luckily, I I got a chance to enjoy this. So it was much interesting, guys. Much interesting than that ride. And I'm finally out. The weather is just like morning. Foggy, foggy everywhere. So Genting Highlands were amazing guys, the ride were amazing and the, sorry. And the closing ceremony was just amazing. At first I was finding it a little bit, the sound was too loud but after seeing that it was very interesting and I liked it very much. Here. This one is quite big and tall. We just stopped by while returning back. We can come here by cable car also, but we prefer driving here. Genting Islands was amazing. The theme park was good, and the, I like the closing ceremony a lot. And this temple is also looking nice. While I'm in Malaysia, I visited a lot of Chinese temple. Almost all the temple looks like same for me because the style, the architecture is similar to one another. This temple is also quite big. It seems like it's very small from outside, but when you come inside, it's big, too many statues. I love the architecture of this type of temple because we do not quite see often in our country. map of Genting Highlands this one is the theme park here I went there and this one is the first old hotel old biggest hotel with room capacity of 7351 but this one is the overall map of Genting Highlands you can look there if you want more information screenshot it and something about Genting Malaysia Berhad is written here Just screenshot it if you want the information guys it will be useful if you are planning to come here 